Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, hey girl, my name is Amir. I'm all things beauty and fashion related here on YouTube with a little bit of life content. So as you can tell by today's title, we're doing a mini haul featuring Misguided once again, okay? I am manifesting to partner with Misguided so we can get this collab going, okay? Make sure that you give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure you leave a comment down below which items were your favorite. Let's chit chat about it, okay? Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell post notification as well. So, now that we got that out the way, let's get into the video. First things first, um, this is the flat curb chain belt and this is in a size medium large and I'm trying to build up my belt collection because accessories really make or break an outfit. It can break it if you have too many on and it can make it if you have the right amount. So if your pants have a belt hoop, I highly suggest you wear a belt just to tie in the look some more. So yeah, I picked up this chain one just to give a little jazz to an outfit. This is a decent size too, so that's what I like. And if you're wondering where I got these pants from right now, make sure that you check out my previous clothing haul that I uploaded. I'll leave it in the cards or in the description box so you guys can check that out so yeah so i wouldn't wear it with this outfit because of the patterns in the shirt it's too much going on this belt is cute i just have to play around with the items that i do have in my closet just to see which works best but this will suffice for right now and here is the close-up of the belt just a chain situation cute i also picked up these earrings right here from misguided as well um i don't know what i did with the tag but i will link it down in the description box as well now this bag this is the rectangular chain pouch bag in the shade orange it's a little bit brighter on camera but in person it is the perfect shade it's almost like a mustard yellow like a burnt mustard yellow and i love i love the color get inside of the bag it doesn't give you a pocket but it does come with a chain this is how it looks without the chain this is cute i want to style this bag with these pants and a different top even with this top, because it's orange in a shirt, it'll go. This is how it looks with the chain. Cute little shoulder bag action. But I will definitely have this as a pouch. Because this is cute like that. You can keep the chain on if you want to hold it as a pouch for an added aesthetic to the look. But yeah, I like this bag. This bag is really cute. Can't wait to wear this outside. And the next bag that I have, this is the Crop PU Top Handle Bag in Candy Pink. This also came in black, I believe. This is how much room you have inside. It does have a zipper pocket and a open pocket right here if you want to store something. And it also comes with a chain. But since the chain is in this little bag, I would just keep it in there for right now i would have this as just a handle bag and not a crossbody or chain bag because i just i just like how this looks all of the accessories that i picked out so let's move into the clothes all right so the first two pieces that i have i'm going to start off with the top so this is just a plain old graphic tee it says misguided and i believe this is the year that it was founded in roman numerals don't quote me on that i'm probably completely wrong but yeah so i believe i got this in a size eight i should have got it in a larger size because i wanted to fit really really oversized i only picked this out because of the gym you know hot girl summer is upon us and yeah if you're not in the gym come on sis come come work out let's go i got this in a size eight i thought i picked up a size 10 but, I mean, it's cool for working out. Nothing special. And then these are the leggings that I picked out. They do come 
to my ankle this is actually from the tall section and i wasn't really paying attention to it I'm not leg tall i'm torso torso tall um just for reference i am five eight and these are the most softest comfortablest it's not a word but it's gonna be a word today but these leggings are are yeah are very very comfortable so it has a cross in the front these are squat approved leggings so i really do like that but this is the only active wear that i picked up so let's move to the next items here is the next item it's this olive green skirt um it comes with a belt and I don't know if I was moving too fast, but this belt is unnecessary to me. Like, it doesn't do anything for this skirt. So, I wouldn't wear it with this. Or it depends on the top that I wear. But, mm -mm, the, no, it's it's not getting, giving it. It has a slight little split in the front. I think I got this in a size 6 and... I should have gotten a size 8 because this elastic band is a little tight around my uh, midsection. But, I mean, hey, we in the gym. So, we're going to lose this little gut and it'll fit nice. But, um, if you want it to fit comfortably, stick to your size. And if you want it to fit more snug, you can go down a size. But just know that it will fit very, very snug on you. If you work in the office, you can wear this as well office appropriate um and you can either wear the slit to the front or to the back so it's up to you here are our next two items so starting off with this bodysuit so this is a light pink racer slinky bodysuit it is a thong bottom so that's a major plus and it's very very soft and it's not see-through which i I absolutely love. I mean, it's a little sleep through on the side. You can see the tag. You can't really see it in a video, but you see it in a person. But it's very comfortable. And I believe this comes in different colors as well. So I will be going back to pick this up in more colors because I actually like this. These pants are hot fire, okay? They are a little see through. Like I can see the bodysuit. Um, coming through the the color a little bit so make sure that you are wearing the correct bottoms with these pants now these are a little bit snug in this area right here so I got these in a size 8 um I would actually pick this up in a size 10 just so it can fit comfortably around my hips like it fits very well in my waist but in these hips baby they are a little bit tight and i am afraid to sit down because i don't want to bust them and they stop a little above my ankle but if you're on the thicker side make sure that you size up because there's no stretch in these pants but i absolutely love the color the only thing that i wish these pants had wear a pocket you know me you know that i love pockets in my pants i think all pants should have pockets so the next item that i have is this bralette this is the howling jersey bralette top and i got this in a size eight i have a vision for this uh this top so it's going to be along the lines of the 90s era so yeah make sure that you keep your eyes out on the pictures when i drop them so i wouldn't wear this alone by itself outside because it's a little bit too much and yeah they are itty bitty titty committee approved so for all of my committee folks my members it works well for us but if you have a bigger chest I don't know what to tell you but be careful okay here we have our final item so it's this baby doll siesta fiesta top now i honestly thought that this part was going to be a lot bigger width wise 
but no and the arms the arms is cute i like how they fluff i like the fluff but they are really tight like you do get um a little security band with the like stopper situation that they want to call it but the bottom half is super tight and it's very uncomfortable and it's giving it's giving tia's and tiara's or what's that show with the little girls in the pageants? That's what's giving. Like it's it's giving baby doll, and I don't I don't like this. I like the pattern, but mind you, I got this in a size eight. I like the pattern, but that's it. I like the pattern in the sleeves. That's it. Everything else I do not like. And I had a vision. This and these pants, they were gonna make some shake for brunch. But they're not shaking the way that I want them to. So, unfortunately, oh, I'm missing the whole earring. Let's pretend that didn't happen. But, um, yeah. No. Thank you. <laughs> I don't like this. So, yeah. Alright, so that wraps up today's video. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. All the links and my sizes will be in the description box. So make sure that you guys check that out as well. Don't forget to check out the previous clothing haul that I just posted. And most importantly, give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure that you are subscribed. I want you to come into the family if you're not a part of it. And don't forget to hit that bell post notification button as well so you'll never miss out on an upload. Once again, thank you guys for tuning in. And I hope I get to see you guys in the next one. Bye.